In this video, we're going to take a look at how we can reduce the index on a radical. Because the index and the exponents can be rewritten as fractions, we know we can reduce these fractions by dividing each by the same common factor. For example, in this first example, the 24th root of a to the 6th, b to the 9th, c to the 15th, we see that all these values, if we thought of them as fractions, can be divided by 3. When we divide the index of 24 by 3, we end up with 6. Nope, how about 8? 24 divided by 3 is 8. There we go. On the a, dividing the exponent of 6 by 3 gives us 2. On the b's, dividing the exponent of 9 by 3 gives us 3. On c, dividing the exponent of 15 by 3 gives us 5. We have now reduced the index down from 24 to 8. Let's take a look at another example. In the second example, the 9th root of 8, m to the 6th, n to the 3rd, we need to be careful to resist the temptation to divide 9, 6, and 3 by 3. Because there is an exponent, there is a number that we need to consider first. Unless we can divide the exponent on this number also by 3, we are not allowed to reduce. To give us some exponents to work with, what we're going to do is factor the 8, divisible by 4 and 2, and 4 is divisible by 2 and 2. Notice we've got 1, 2, 3, 8, 3 twos. Let's rewrite that in exponent form as 2 to the 3rd power, m to the 6th, n to the 3rd. Now that the number does have an exponent, now we are allowed to reduce the entire expression. We can divide the index and the exponents all by 3. Dividing the index of 9 by 3 gives us 3. On the 2, dividing the exponent of 3 by 3 gives us 1. We don't have to write the 1. On the m, 6 divided by 3 is 2. And on the n, 3 divided by 3 is 1. But again, we don't have to write the 1. Our final answer when we simplified the index is the cube root of 2, m squared, n. The way we divide the... The way we reduce the index on a radical is we divide the exponents and the index by the same common factor. If there is a number, we need to first find the prime factorization of that number so we can work with its exponents as well.